welcome see the solution of by quadratic equation by euler's method here we will start with this assumption x equals to root p plus root q plus root r squaring both sides what we can write x square equals to i think you can remember a plus b plus c whole square that is equals to a square plus b square plus c square plus 2 into ab plus bc plus ca so using that one we can write p plus q plus r plus 2 root pq plus root q1 plus root r this one again we can write in this style x square minus p plus q plus r equals to 2 root of pq plus root q1 plus root r now once again squaring both sides what we can get x4 minus 2 p plus q plus r into x square plus p plus q plus r whole square equals to 4 into again using the same thing a plus b plus c whole square it will be p q plus q r plus r p plus 2 into now it will be this one into this one we can write root q into root p q r plus similarly this one into this one root r into root p q r plus root p into root p q r this one we can rewrite as x4 minus 2 p plus q plus r x square plus p plus q plus r whole square equals to 4 into p q plus q r plus r p plus 8 root p q r we can take common then it will remain inside will be root p plus root q plus root r this one we can rewrite as x4 minus 2 into p plus q plus r x square then root p, q, <coughs> p plus q root q plus root r is our assumption is x so it will write as if we are taking this side minus 8 root p q r x plus p plus q plus r whole square minus of this one for p q plus q r plus r p this is equals to zero now comparing with the given equation so we can write p plus q plus r equals to 1 the repeat is 1 then only minus 2x square and root p q r is plus 8x is there so it is equals to minus 1 from here we can write p q r equals to 1 and p q plus q r plus r p equals to minus 4 is there and this one 
Okay, we can rewrite this portion once again. That is P plus Q plus R whole square minus 4 into PQ plus QR plus RP. This one equals to minus 3. And we are doing P plus Q plus R is 1. So it is 1. So <coughs> if it is. So from here what we can say PQ plus QR plus RP. This is also equals to 1. Because 1 minus 4 equals to minus 3. So we are getting this value. From here we can say this PQR are the roots of a cubic equation PQ minus sum of the roots into T square. Sum of the roots is 1. So it is PQ minus T square plus <coughs> pair, pairwise sum is this one. So plus pairwise sum 1 into t minus product of the roots. Product of the roots is 1. So it is minus 1. This is equals to 0. This is called Euler's cube. This is the Euler's cubic equation we formed for this one. From here we can proceed that is t square into t minus 1 plus t minus 1 equals to 0 that is t minus 1 into t square plus 1 equals to 0 from here what we are getting t equals to 1 and from here t square plus 1 equals to 0 that is t square equals to minus 1 minus 1 is i square so t square equals to i square that is t equals to plus minus i 1 is plus i 1 is minus i these are the three values we are getting now we will proceed further in the help of this one we will proceed such that our, what we can assume P equals to 1, Q equals to I, because we have a P, these are the PQ1 are the roots of this cubic. So Q equals to I, R equals to minus I. But our roots were this one, we require root P. So root P equals to plus minus 1 root q equals to plus minus root i see this one equals to plus minus root of half into 2i 2i i will write in this time 1 plus 2i minus 1 you are knowing this method see i am showing you equals to 1 by root 2 plus minus 1 by root 2 into this 1 plus 2i minus 1 minus 1 I can consider as i square 1 plus 2i plus i square is 1 plus i whole square so it will be inside root 1 plus i whole square means 1 plus i root q equals to this one Similarly, root r equals to plus minus root of minus i. We will follow the same style. It will be 1 minus 2i minus 1 and it will be 1 minus i. So, equals to plus minus 1 by root 2 into 1 minus i. These are the values we are getting. Our x is root p plus root q plus root r x equals to root p plus root q plus root r now see here you have to remember this one here in this particular case 
root pq r equals to minus 1 it's a negative quantity root that means product of the three will be negative for product of the three will be negative either all the three in this plus minus cases all the three will be negative or only one will be negative suppose one that we can take x is if one by root two into one plus i and r as negative so minus one by root two one minus i in this case it is coming as one plus one by root two one plus i minus one plus i that is two i that is equals to one plus i root two now if we are taking this is equals to one minus one by root two one plus i and this one is plus one by root two one minus i so this one will come as in the same style one minus i root two now we may take that is here minus one so it is coming minus one and both others are plus plus 1 by root 2 into 1 plus i plus 1 by root 2 into 1 minus i so it is coming equals to minus 1 plus 1 by root 2 into 1 plus i plus 1 minus i will be 2 that is equals to 1 plus root 2 other possibility is minus 1 and all minus minus 1 by root 2 1 plus i minus 1 by root 2 1 minus i in this case it is coming as in the same style it will be minus 1 minus 1 by root 2 into 2 that is equals to this is coming as minus 1 minus root 2 so we are getting four solutions one is 1 plus i root 2 another is 1 minus i root 2 one is minus 1 plus root 2 minus 1 minus root 2 in this way, here from all this plus minus, we have to choose according to this given condition. This condition we derive, accordingly we have to choose which values we will take. This combination we have to choose correctly and we can solve this equation.